Hi guys and welcome back. So if you're wondering why I look the same as one of my previous videos, which is my BoxyCharm unboxing, um, I just decided to film two videos in one day because it's easier. So today's video is going to be a review. So the other day I went to Walmart to do some shopping. So like always, I'm like a freaking magnet and I just get sucked into the makeup aisle. So I noticed these new palettes and I was like hmm that looks interesting unfortunately at the Walmart that I was in they didn't have this one the nude one <clears throat> there's two this is the nude one and then there's another one that's like more like plummy colors so I finally found it and when I saw it I was like hmm this looks very interesting the colors are really pretty they're definitely right up my alley because they are nude so first of all, let me rewind and say who the brand is. So these are the new palettes by L'Oreal Paris and these are called La Palette Nude 1 and these are gorgeous. Wow, I am so impressed by these eyeshadows. Like I have never seen any drugstore eyeshadows that have beat these, like ever. These are amazing. So first of all, the colors are absolutely gorgeous. You have some shimmer colors, you have your matte colors, and all of them swatch beautifully. Like, I'm not even joking. I did post a picture on Instagram, and I was just blown away by the pigmentation. I did swatch them with no um, concealer or any, what's it called? Eyeshadow base. And these are amazing, guys. Now, these retail for $15, which they're really pricey for them being a drugstore item, but they're totally worth it. So I'm glad that they came out with something that is really nice, really pigmented. It offers a variety of colors. You have a variety of, sh of shimmer shades and matte shades. So you get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You get seven um, shimmery shades and they're not too shimmery or glittery. They're like the perfect amount of shimmer. And you get one, two, three, three matte colors, which the three matte colors that are in here are amazing. First color here is a really nice shimmery, like a pink champagne color. Number two is a really nice like taupey gray shimmery color. The third one is a really nice shimmery brown. The fourth one is more of a bronzy shade and it's also a shimmer. The fifth one is a matte color and it's like a taupey brown which is one of my favorite colors from the palettes. Then from there it has a really nice like tan color. I don't know how to describe it. It's just like a really soft brown. I guess that's how I would describe it. From there you get like a really nice gold shimmer color which is absolutely gorgeous. And then this one is another one of my favorite shades and it's a really nice nude um, shade which is perfect for like the crease or for, for blending out your colors. Then the second to last color is a really nice like a rose gold color but it has a little bit of like that diamond white diamond shimmer. I don't know if that makes sense. And then the last one is a complete vanilla shade, which is perfect for your inner corner, which is what I'm wearing right now. Um, and then another awesome thing is on the back. On the back, you get um, the shadows by their number. So it starts one, two, three, blah, 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 blah. It goes up to the number 10. So you start from here up to number 10. And then it also has some little eyes on here, which it has some hazel ones, it has blue ones, green ones, and brown ones, which will tell you what colors suits your eye color the best. And it also tells you how to apply your eyeshadow. For example, the brown one, I tested it out today and it's what I'm wearing on my eyes. It's the brown one, so it says, the number five goes in the inner corner, number six above the pupil, number eight on the outer lid, and then six on the bottom lashes. So I pretty much followed each step. I did tweak it a little bit and made it, I know, my own little concoction, but I still followed it. I thought that was a pretty cool idea, especially if you are maybe a beginner and you want to start with some nude colors, but you don't exactly know how to apply them, then you can just guide yourself by this and then, you know, just move on from there. So, yeah, I mean, I don't even know what to say about this product. It's it's really good. I really 
honestly like it. I think I'm even going to go ahead and pick up the second palettes. I originally didn't get them both because, again, I thought they were pretty pricey for being drugstore. So, yeah, I mean, I don't even know what to tell you guys. These palettes are just, they're really, really good. I really like them. I don't feel like they're chalky at all. They're really buttery. And I didn't have any fallout when I was applying my makeup, like, at all. So that's another great thing to say about them. So that is my review on this new palette. Again, let me know if you guys have seen these or if you've tried them. So let me know if you guys have seen them, if you're going to try them or if you have tried them. So yeah, I think that is everything that I wanted to say. Uh, this is why I hate wearing my hair down. I feel like I have like bellows all over my face and I'm always touching my hair. My mom would always get so mad at me when when I used to live with her and I would have my hair down I was always like combing through my hair and like moving it and poofing it and she would just be like yeah déjate ese pelo so yeah random story so thank you guys so much for watching again let me know if you guys want to see a makeup tutorial or this makeup tutorial with that palette and I will get that out for you guys thank you guys so much for watching please subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you guys in my next video Bye!